The architect renders his services to you by making buildings, design, and drawings, and based on that helps you with the on-site execution. But when architects start their services with architectural, interior, structural, MEP, lifestyle design and drawings with coordination and project estimation and costing, product and material management with the research work etc. then the architect is called an architect design consultant. The design consultant must have a deep understanding of all the services as well as experience in design drawings coordination. Coordination with the on-site construction team is also part of the design consultant's service. It all depends on following the instructions given by the design consultant. When an architect starts providing his services with an architectural design consultancy, then his responsibility becomes even more. Then he is also a business consultant with design consultant, which is a huge responsibility. This directly benefits the patron, client. When a patron, client, selects an architect for their building designing, it is easy and convenient for the patron, client, to select a design consultant with all the services. Because the patron, client, gets all the architectural service coordination in one place. Thereby managing time and money with peaceful execution. Which is also a correct procedure, which we recommend to all. Like everyone wears clothes, someone buys from roadside sidewalk, someone buys from budget shop, someone buys on offer from showroom or someone prefers to wear branded clothes. Everyone chooses wearable clothes according to their budget and self-esteem. In the same way all people live in buildings, some people make their own buildings without design, some people build buildings by taking basic design from architect, some people take design from architect but do not follow the design, people who choose design consultants architect. They are always satisfied. Often you must have seen that we keep on calling some neighborhood service providers like electrician and plumber in the name of repair in our building, about which we do not even know whether they are technically educated or not. They go away with service charge from you and this process goes on frequently. If you have such a trend here too, then definitely calculate the expenses of the month and year and know what is the reason of this unwanted relationship. Can it be completely cured in one go where you don't need maintenance again and again? Dampness in the building is a big problem which often occurs in every building. The basic reason of which is not to check the line properly at the time of construction, which should be done with pressure pump and leakage should be checked. But in order to save money, people work without technically educated plumber and then they keep getting upset. One reason can also be the lack of proper ventilation, which can be easily identified by anyone. Problems related to plumbing can be prevented if proper attention is given to water saving system, water flow in water lines, smooth working of sewer lines etc. at the time of construction itself. But how many people pay attention to it? There are usually three types of electrical problems found in buildings. The first is the lack of proper earthing. The second is the lack of tightness of the wire at the joints or at the MCB or on the switch. And the third is close contact with water lines or dampness. Any accidents can be avoided if proper wires, 
MCB and switches are installed according to the electrical load and these are taken care of at the time of construction. Any disaster in the building use can be prevented by taking the services of an architect or architect design consultant. You yourself think that the disasters that come in the building, they often happen in the buildings built at the behest of who, who built them. In order to save the professional charges of the design consultant, people build the building on the basic design sketch of the architect with the help of Raj Mystery, labor, contractor or builder, then how can the disasters in the building be prevented? Design consultant architects provide services to you as they are experts in the profession and know about the safety, comfort and luxury in buildings as per your budget. If you think you can save the professional fee of design consultant architect then it might be the risk of your life. You cannot generate your life again. How can you assure your family of a safe building when you cannot make your own building safe? Architect can be an individual professional who provides all the services related to the building along with designing in which the responsibility of all the services is not of any service provider only that architect or architect firm. Due to the staff culture, this process is very old and expensive. Design consultant architect renders his services with a group of consultants in which all the service providers take responsibility for their services which include all the approvals and NOCs all of whom are qualified, well-educated, experienced and technically competent. They all are either in the form of a consultant firm or an individual registered consultant, in which the responsibility of coordination along with the complete project lies with the design consultant architect. It is a very safe and economical process. This is the preferred process of today's era, which is adopted in almost every small and big project. For this reason, most patrons, clients, rely on a design consultant architect. As a professional, we recommend to everyone select design consultant architect always, avoid all man-made disaster in building and stay happy. We'll be back soon with a new topic and new video. Stay connected with us. Don't forget to like, share the channel. If you are visiting this channel for the first time, then subscribe and click on the bell icon. Hope it will help you to make aware about right decision. Thank you.